Hey, what's up, guys? Thank you so, so much for all the support. Seriously, I am so grateful. I wanted to dedicate this vid to everyone who has helped me grow this channel to reach this milestone. And I want to start from the very beginning. I would like to give a shout out to all my Rainbow Six Vegas homies. Silent Sneaker, Treason, Cyclonus, Stormax, Confusion, Hartley, Takeover, Dante, Nex, Zex, Jester, Mag, Mag Jr., Exclusive Procedure, and finally my bro Kyle. But really I wanted to highlight uh, two individuals in particularly who kind of were the turning point for the growth of this channel. And those two individuals are Baited and Brenna and I am a Mish. For those of you who don't know Baited and Brenna, Brenna is pretty much the main actor behind all competitive events that Dark Souls 3 really ever had. Uh, he's always been like the main tournament host, the best tournament host, and the gold standard for any event that uh, this game really ever offered. And it's because of Brenda's work through all his tournaments that we got the channel to 1,000 subs uh, a few years ago. And if it wasn't for his work for the community, we wouldn't be here. So thank you so much, Brenna. I really appreciate it. So guys, don't forget to, to check out Brenna because I am sure Brenna is going to be hosting more tournaments for Elden Ring. So you will want to check, check him out, have an eye out for anything Brenna organizes in the upcoming future. And I also want to highlight uh, my good friend Amish. Amish always have been very supportive of the, of the channel. Pretty much uh, always, you know, sending people my way. Hamish has never really been shy of promoting the channel as well as other content creators. So um, I think it's well worth it that we mention the contribution that Hamish had on the channel, which is very significant. So wouldn't be here without his help as well. So Hamish, thank you so, so much, my friend. Um, I'm sure Hamish and I will continue to uh, to make vids together. Uh, as uh, as Elden Ring comes along. Then I'd also like to specifically thank some of the people who have m helped me out greatly throughout this journey. And uh, I want to start with my friend Vale. Um, see, the thing is, uh, as you get bigger and bigger and more popular, it, I feel like it, it gets harder to find people that you can rely on only God knows how hard it is to find people that you can 100% trust. And I can say with confidence that Vale is one of them. Then we also got my good buddy Hollowweed. For those of you who don't know Hollow, uh, Hollowweed has helped me out greatly for <laughs> various things, whether it's like technical stuff for OBS or uh, <laughs> admin related stuff. Twitch related stuff uh, he's always he's always there if I need help so I I wanted to highlight um, how much uh, devil which is which which was his his holder name how much devil has helped me over time I really appreciate it thank you so much bro moving on we got the Gaber um, Gabri being very popular these days with his, his reddit post uh, Gabri has been around since early 2017 has helped me out greatly uh, throughout the years very thankful for him moving on we got Spectre Spectre as well always there to help me test stuff you know whenever I need some help always grateful to have Spectre around same with Akrish who actually has nothing public on his his Twitch, I think his VODs get deleted. Well, same with Hackrish. Always grateful to have Hackrish help me out with whatever I need as well. And then we also got Nash here. Nash, not very useful, but I still wanted to put him in there. So Nash is going to make himself useful in the future. You'll see him more in the channels. I think he'll get more involved with Elden Ring, but um, not useful yet to become useful, Nash. <laughs> 
And then we actually got Chase here. Uh, the reason why I put Chase, uh, well, I, I did not really get to talk to Chase uh, that much. Uh, the few times I did get to talk to him, he did give me some good advice and uh, that really helped push the, the channel further. Uh, YouTube related stuff. Uh, it's really because of Chase that I started uploading, you know, uh, one video a day and uh, which eventually became two vids a day which is uh, what we got going on now but yeah always always grateful we also got sunlight blade sunlight blade pretty cool dude honestly um we've been highlighted in uh sunlight's top 10 i forgot which month it was but i only entry I ever sent to Sunlight was number one in this top 10, so we're, we'll never send any other entry ever again. No, I'm just kidding. But uh, the the spotlight on Sunlight definitely brought uh, some good attention to the channel and helped uh, helped us grow a lot. And the thing with Sunlight is that he doesn't, uh, you know, he shares pretty much his spotlight with everyone. When he does these vids and so uh, sunlight blood has helped out so many different channels here small channels to get known it's very wor well worth it to to have in, in in here and to thank him i also want to give a special thank you to uh, the people who are behind the discord the warriors who are behind the discord uh, these people are responsible for making and keeping the discord amazing and uh, the discord would never be the place it is now uh, without Jane white work uh, Jane is pretty much uh, the main actor running the discord at the moment and uh, I am so grateful for uh, for his, his contribution uh, it's because of people like Jane that we can do what we're doing here so thank you so so much Jane in the same vein, I really want to thank Survival Horrors, who's also very involved with the Discord as well. So, really, Survival and Jane are the two main actors who are com contributing and running the Discord. And so, for those of you who don't know, you can join our Discord. This is where we talk anything uh, PvP-related. Uh, if you want to improve, get better, this is the place to go. And uh, we will be sharing knowledge for Elden Ring when it comes out and uh, yeah if you want to improve share information get information this is the place to be also while i do not have a channel for my friend fady here <laughs> fady is pretty much responsible for shaping up the discord as it is now when i created the discord it was as bare bone as it gets and fady pretty much elevated the discord to a gold standard and so i am so grateful for all of all of what fady has done for the channel for the discord for the community really appreciate you fady if you're seeing this thank you so much bro we also got tesu tesu also pretty active in the discord making sure everyone stays in line um uh, Tesu also gave us the Elden Ring network test code. So the reason why we have Elden Ring content to show you is because of Tesu. So thank you so much, Tesu. Really appreciate that. I also want to thank uh, Gogo Zebra, who I don't have anything to link, but Gogo always there for all the the the, the Twitch uh, <laughs> the Twitch streams, always there to mod and to uh, ban pretty much everyone on site who doesn't fall in line. So thank you so much, Gogo. Also, special thanks to my buddy Castle. Castle, absolutely nothing special that he has done to help me, but I still want to put him put his name in there. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on, I would like to thank some of our sponsors, the people who have put food on the table for us while this channel was growing. And I'm talking about no one but our buddy here, Marcus. Um, honestly, I'm not going to tell you guys how much Marcus has donated to the channel, but it's a lot. Marcus, thank you so, so much, man. Honestly, it, um, it means a lot and you're one of the biggest reasons why we're here now. So thank you so, so much, Marcus. On the same vein, 
The reason why we got so many emotes on Twitch is because of our, of our friend here, Gundir's Champion, who's contributed massively uh, for the channel, especially when, uh, when the Twitch was much smaller, which enabled us to have all these emotes. And so I'm very grateful for uh, your contribution, Gundir's Champion. We also got Yem. Yem contributing from the shadows, never there in the streams, but always lurks here and there and has contributed massively as well. So Yem, thank you so, so much, my friend. And it's not because, you know, this is a company that we cannot give a shout out to AFK Creators. Uh, the team at AFK Creators pretty much gave us some sponsorship opportunities and it was a blast to work with them. So thanks for the team at AFK Creator, much appreciated. And then in a different vein, I also want to highlight where it all started because as you might or might not know, before being a tournament champion at Dark Souls 3, I also won tournaments in For Honor and was also a pro player at, in Rainbow Six Vegas 2. Um, for those of you wondering, you can actually check out my ELO rank on game battles. For those of you who wonder, like, I've never actually told anyone, but uh, the game battle page is actually always uh, linked here at the top right of the channel. But yeah, where I was going with this is that um, while I was good at other games, we didn't become good overnight. And when I started playing Dark Souls 3, these were the people that I looked up to and that I learned from. The Whammy here was really the first person I started learning things from. And <laughs> specifically, I remember the Whammy had some tutorials on how to ring swap. And so we actually learned how to do our first ring swap watching the Whammy and his tutorials. And so while I don't think he's very active right now, I think it's worth giving a shout out to Whammy for getting us uh, started with our journey on becoming better at Dark Souls 3. And in the same vein, I did not get good at backstabbing overnight. This is relevant for Elden Ring, for all the backstab haters out there. I should watch some old Platinum 7 stuff. This is the man I used to... Uh, Used to watch, don't think he's very active anymore, but I still see him around uh, on Twitch. So I, I know you might be watching this. Uh, hi, Platinum. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> so yeah, we uh, we used to watch Platinum a lot. Uh, that's pretty much what I, like the person I looked up to when learning how to backstab, like back in 2016 when Dark Souls 3 had just came out. And so I wanted to give a shout out to Platinum. We also got Lingberg, uh, Lingberg here. Shy girl, you know, deleted all his content, unfortunately. Didn't really know before filming this, but yeah, um, about the swapping stuff, I used to watch uh, Lingberg as well. So uh, thanks, Lingberg. Unfortunately, deleted his stuff. And finally, we got Scott John, the Scott who does not really need an introduction, but for those of you who don't know Scott, pretty much the forefather of Dark Souls 3 competitive PvP, <laughs> at least as far as YouTubers go. Um, for me personally, like I did not even know like tournaments were a thing in Dark Souls 3 until I watched Scott Jun. And so Scott Jun was really my introduction to uh, any sort of uh, remotely competitive aspect of Dark Souls 3. And um, that's pretty much how I got started with tournaments and dueling and, and taking uh, Dark Souls 3 a bit, a bit more serious. And so I'm very grateful for that. Thank you so much, Scott, uh, if you're ever watching this. I really appreciate that. And uh, yeah, I also have a little announcement. For those of you who don't know, we do have our merch store. And uh, to thank you guys for all the support for the 10K subs. I have a promotion, 10% off for 10K subs. <laughs> promotion code is 10KG9. It will be... Linked in the description for those of you who want to, you know, a Christmas gift to to give to someone. Uh, we got, you know, female, male shirts, hoodies, some good stuff. Obviously here they're all shown as black or white, but if you click on them, um, there's, a, there's a wide range of colors that you can choose from. Oops, showing the back here. Also, for the record, all the 
design work that is done here is all made by myself entirely so you're not just supporting the channel you're also supporting the artist and I much appreciate it and finally before we close this I have made a long list of all content creators that uh, make Dark Souls 3 content and will most likely be making Elden Ring content as well uh, I've compiled a list of pretty much everything or everyone that I know of uh, that might be of interest to you guys. Uh, yeah, you guys should check out all the content creators if you haven't already that uh, I will have on this list. This is my part for thanking you guys who have helped me reach 10k subs. Again, really appreciate all your support and uh, thank you again so much guys. Catch you guys up next time.